diagram shows part of the curve y equals to x squared minus 2x plus 3 and the tangent line which is the orange line y equals to 2x plus c which is tangent to the curve at the point A you are to find the coordinates of A and the value of the constant C by looking at the orange line which is in the form of y mx plus c you can tell that the gradient is equals to 2 so the orange line has a gradient of 2 and since it is tangent to the curve at the point A that means the curve the curve also has a gradient equals to 2 at the point A so if you differentiate the curve if you differentiate the curve to get your dy dx you sub in the gradient 2 you will be able to find x let me demonstrate to you the curve is x squared minus 2x plus 3 you differentiate by differentiating it you get a gradient function which means that you can find the gradient at any point on the curve including the point A so at the point A we understand that it has a gradient of 2 because the tangent to the curve at the point A is the line y equals to 2x plus c which has a gradient of 2 therefore the gradient of the curve at the point A is also 2 solving this equation you get x equals to 2. That means the point A has an x coordinate of 2. Now we need to find the y coordinate of A. That is easy. Just sub x equals to 2 into y. So your y will be equals to 2 square minus 2 times 2 plus 3 that gives you 3 so you have done part A right part A A is equals to x2 y3 that's the answer part B is very easy because the point A also lies on the line y equals to 2x plus c hence for part b we can sub x equals to 2 y equals to 3 into y equals to 2x plus c because the line y equals to 2x plus c passes through the point a passes through x equals to 2 and y equals to 3 so by substituting we obtain c is equals to negative 1